Why aren't you out there knocking down trees? You're right. I should be. I'm leaving. I'm getting out of here. Thank you. I have a family, Mr. Richfield. I can't afford to get my wife a present, and I can't afford to buy my children the things that I'd like to. Tree pushers get $4 an hour. Well, I need a raise. Yeah, it's good. Give me one second. <laughs> Sinclair, you dog. 20 years you work here, I never would have figured you had it in you to come in here and take me on. But take me on, you do. Mano a mano, one on one. That's guts ball, Sinclair. I like a guy who plays guts ball. Like it. Ah. Oh, uh, thank you, sir. So, I guess I'm going to have to take your little ultimatum seriously, aren't I? Oh, I would appreciate that, sir. Oh, the guy comes in here and puts a gun to my head. No, 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 I meant no gun, sir. Must be prepared to back up his threat. So, I'm going to ask you, you want to raise or what? Uh, or not. What puts you in the position to come in here with your slate of demands? Well, uh, I got a wife and a family. Well, where is this my fault? I'm not blaming you. Then why do I have to pay for your family? I just need more money. Yeah, the way I see it, you don't need more money. You need less family. But, but, but I love my family. Well, obviously you do since you're ready to quit your job form. What? You face me down, demand more money, I ain't gonna give it to you. So you got no alternative but to look me in the eye and say... I'm sorry. I quit! I quit! Oh, well, sorry to lose you, Sinclair, all these years. But, sir, I like this company. I always dreamed I'd go somewhere with this company. Don't dream, Sinclair. No dreams for you. You are what you are, and that's all you ever gonna be. Except now with this company. Best thing for you to do is realize that now. Best thing in the world. You'll thank me. But, but sir, thank me! Uh, thank you. Thank you ever so, uh, Mr. Mr. Uh, goodbye. Thank <sighs> you.